Hi, welcome to a training video on Insightly, a CRM and project management software package by Google Apps Marketplace. Some of the main features that I would like to show off is that Insightly ties to mail, it ties to calendar, and Insightly also ties well to contacts. Contacts can be imported from your regular Gmail account list. Let's get into the program, shall we? You're first presented with the main dashboard when you log in. Other features include tasks, task management, and contacts. Let's take a look at tasks. Right now we have a whole number of tasks. Contacts. We can add a contact on the fly if we haven't already imported them. I'm really excited about this feature because not only when you add the contact, you add their name, you can add their title, but you also add their organization. There's another screen where you add details about their telephone number, their email, their birthday if you want. I'm not going to go that deep into it at the moment. You can figure that out when you get into the program. So once you click Add Change, you will see that the contact has been updated as well as the organization for which they belong to. What's nice about that is that you can add multiple contacts per organization. Now we're going to go ahead and update an opportunity. So in our example, we're going to have a speaking program. at the consulting consortium and the opportunity is we're, we're approaching them to see if we can be a keynote address speaker at the consulting consortium. We're going to tie some other things into this opportunity like the anticipated value thousand dollars which category it fits into the categories are customizable the percentage of winning the probability of winning at seventy percent um, the forecast close date you know, in about a month or so from the making of this. Now we're going to add the opportunity. So now that opportunity is tied to Joe Schmo and Schmo Consulting. Next thing I want to do is demonstrate how you can add a task for um, Joe Schmo. And the task is going to be, well, I want to I want to email him and indicate my availability dates. So this is a reminder. And if you work in a single person shop, these are all reminders to your to yourself. If you work with a multiple person organization, these tasks can be delegated. That's the beauty of it. Category is email. Save and close. Uh, not before I set myself a reminder, though. So that's where it ties into sending yourself an email or one of your subordinates or coworkers an email, reminding you to ping Mr. Joe Schmo and ask him what the availability needs to be. So down here, where the red arrow is, you can see that an, a task was created on your task dashboard. Now we're going to go over into email and for simplicity I'm using my own email address but the beauty of it is in the blind carbon copy area is the Insightly email box that reminds all uh, email correspondence back and forth to be tied to Joe Schmo and or tied to 
the opportunity for speaking at the consulting consortium in our example. So I send that email and now I'm going to demonstrate where that email shows up. Go over to the emails tab and all conversations with Joe Schmo are tied to um, tied to the email integration feature. There's the, there's the email that was sent out moments ago. And here's the body of the email just for visualization purposes. It's really awesome that it's all tied together, it's all integrated, it's all very simple. Down here now we're going to show where assuming that we won the bid for uh, the speaking program at the consulting consortium we're going to change the status. Status is now saved and updated and we're going to convert we're going to convert. So as we convert it to a project, we're going to give it a new project name and call it keynote address consulting consortium. Save the project name and it is no longer in the opportunity category, but it's under the projects category. And just to kind of reiterate the point, we can also create a, a task for this project. Here's your keynote address consulting consortium in the projects list. I want to create a task. I want to say um, something to the effect of, okay, now that we've won it on a verbal agreement, I need to send him a contract. So the name of this task, of course, is to finalize the contract. can be uh, categorized as follow-up and also um, you can set a start date and an expected completion date for it. It will remind you. It can be exported to calendar. Um, save and return the project. Save and return to project. and there is the task that's tied to that project. You can also see it in tasks in the major uh, main task uh, dashboard, finalize contract. So that's a brief overview of how you use Insightly and it's extremely simple. Uh, I would suggest that you give it a try and of course it's free for smaller accounts.